This video is for the Winter Trees card. Once the Silhouette Studio program has been opened, go to File, Open, and you want to locate the Christmas Card Project file folder on the desktop, Open, Open the Winter Trees card within that file, and select Winter Trees Layer 1, hit OK. And now our Winter Trees Layer 1 file is open. Let's go ahead and open up our second layer. Go to Open, Winter Trees Layer 2. And now you have the Winter Trees Layer 2 also opened up in the Silhouette Studio program. You switch back and forth between the two files by clicking on the tabs over here in the lower left corner. Now, once you've loaded the cutting mat with your cardstock into the Cameo Silhouette, the mats we are using are 12 by 12. However, you may be using 8 and a half, 11 um, cardstock. Right now, the files are set up automatically for 12 by 12. If you're using an 8 and a half, 11, it's very simple to change. Over here to Page Settings, which is this button here, click on that, and then select this page paper size. Scroll down, select letter, and of course your, your uh, cutting mat size will remain the same since we are using a 12 by 12 mat. When you've double checked everything, it all looks like it's in the right position and you're ready to cut. Over here to the top right hand corner, click on the send to silhouette button. And then um, this computer that I have is not hooked up to the Silhouette device, but what you'll find down here is um, the computer that you will be using will have a start button. Simply hit start and the Cameo machine will begin cutting. Do this for both files. Click on Winter Trees Layer 2 and again you'll do the same thing. You're using a 12 inch by 12 inch mat. However, if you're using 8.5 by 11 cardstock, Again, go to the page settings window, click on the arrow, scroll down just a little bit, and select letter paper. And again, if you're using 12 by 12, you can simply switch back by scrolling down and selecting 12 inch by 12 inch. And again, there's no need to change the cutting max settings because the cutting mat size that we are using is a 12 by 12. And that's all the information you need to import basic files and to begin cutting. Good luck and have fun.